Well, there's two explanations. First of all, that the Bible was written by a bunch of different people and couldn't get their story straight, and there was redaction later on, versus this stuff really happened, and uh, there's just the, these inconsistencies are evidence that it did happen. You know, and to choose amongst those two, I would say it's much more likely, and based on independent evidence, that the Bible is simply a pastiche of different stories from different people. How does science sure. prove that... Uh, mm. those truth claims didn't actually happen. Can we prove that natural laws are consistent and never broken by God? Well, that's a, there's two questions there. The second one is, oh, we can't prove anything in science. That, first of all, that's the first misconception. All we can do is get better and better explanations for reality that predict what we see. But we don't have absolute proof in the sense that we have in mathematics. All we can do is investigate every possible instantiation that we can of the laws of physics. And what we find is that they're not broken. So all we can say is, to the best of our knowledge, the laws of physics are absolute and uncontravened in our time. But it makes it less likely in my opinion. well it doesn't it doesn't prove that santa claus didn't exist either i mean correct I mean, jihadis is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in muslim majority countries advocating for atheists secularists and enlightenment thinkers we want to reach out to more people if we reach 500 patrons we will be able to translate our shows into arabic urdu persian bengali malay turkish and other languages in these countries Help us get there at patreon.com slash SJME.